day, lovely ladies and gentlemen. I'm Sake, and welcome back to a continuation of my Let's Play of uh, Lost Planet. We're pretty much, I believe, close to the end. Don't quote me on that. I hope so. But yeah, we're gonna continue it. We're close to the end. I'll hopefully finish it, and after it we're gonna go to the very first Assassin's Creed. Mainly because someone wanted me to play the our Assassin's Creed. My memory loss is probably related to this. What? I'll let them talk. Got more to say, obviously. Fillion. Thank you. I can understand you being upset. I'd be I don't lying know. if I said I wasn't. I think we saw this but before, but you were betrayed too. And I'm sorry you had to feel what we felt. Anyway, <laughs> having trouble with forgiving you for dragging Wayne into that trap. I'm having trouble understanding why you did it. Anyway, it's all water under the bridge now. <laughs> it's so anime of just forgiving yeah. people. I'll make it up to you somehow. Also, the lip sync is still way off. I see. So that's what was going on. You believe me? Of course. Why wouldn't I? Well, I could hardly believe it myself when I first heard it. Well, it's hard to swallow, but I trust you. Oh. Commander! What? We still have time. I'll guide you to the orbital elevator. Luca. Can I have a moment with Joe? With it's random right. Joe? Did you say it's alright? Or was it just me, just me talking over that I didn't hear it, him say something? What's with the serious face? I never knew that the Frontier system would eradicate all life on the planet when it was put into motion. Sorry? World of the Acred. Trust me. I wanted to check if I'm recording. I believe Go you. Away, you do? Now, how do we reach the elevator? Oh, yeah. There's a shortcut. It's the quickest route, but it'll take us straight through an acrid hive. I know how the acrid behave. I can guide us so that we avoid as many of them as possible. No problem. I'll shoot him down. We're counting on you. <laughs> this is so adamant. They just, they just trust him. Once we're through, we can worry about the rest of the journey. Okay. <laughs> Mission 10! Alright, 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 alright! Oh god, I forgot how slow the, the sensitivity was in this game. And the walking! <laughs> Probably get some weaponry. Damn it! Uh, safety, are you ex? Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, bro. How did I change weapons again? Yeah. Okay. Ah! Oh, no, no. How do I dodge roll? Ready. 
Yeah, you better fall into the shooting me. Fall through the map. game ever but I love it a game can be faulty and I can still love it what's that beeping noise should I go over there down there looks like a dead end so I think yes Oh, oh, oh. I think I'll keep the shotgun.
avoid it. What are they fighting? Well, suppose there's some kind of dash! Play more mechs. Oh. Boy. Get it yet? I'll be waiting on the other side of the hive. Come on, click it away. Those take so much energy. But are so awesome! <laughs> ah, have I ever mentioned that I like giant mechs? Especially the one that's in this game. I feel like there's a boss fight right ahead of us. Shotgun. That. Pick that up again. Ready. Enter. Oh god, it's so much more. And it burns through energy quite fast. Oh boy, boss fight. Why did I do that? Yeah, you I don't even see a weak point yet! Hey, weak point. Can I shoot at it directly? Yes. Where are you? Good point. What am I supposed to do? Aim at? Those things?
So far this fight has been incredibly easy. Flame damaging it. Wait. I think I got while we fight that thing. Hey! I love this game so much. Luckily, it made a perfect path for me. Cutscene, and then we should be fine for this episode. And I think we're just gonna go. I'm gonna put Minecraft on a hiatus for now. From here on, we're treading into Nevik territory. We finally arrived. Here. What's this? A friend of yours gave it to me. Friend? You don't mean... Yuri? Yeah, he do. He was the one that approached me. He was trying to explain a lot of different things. But at the time, I trusted Eisenberg and couldn't believe a word of what Yuri was saying. I kept my distance from him for a while. But one time he said he had to meet me and that it was urgent. I went to the designated spot, but all I found was a note and that device. What did the note say? It said, make sure this device finds its way to a snow pirate named Wayne. When Eisenberg ordered me to make contact with the very same person, it put me on edge. What about Yuri? Where is he now? What I've heard confirms what Eisenberg said. 
that he was thrown into a containment facility. It wasn't just because of his involvement in the Frontier Project, but also due to his sniffing around too much. Where are they holding him? Do you know? Conveniently enough, it's on the way to the orbital elevator. Let's go. Rick, huh? <sighs> Hold on to that for me. Gotcha. Why give me now? Thank you. You could have done before the quest. Done more than enough for us already. What? I get the feeling there's unfinished business you need to resolve. We should split up from here. <laughs> the rest of the route has been programmed into your trailer's main computer. <laughs> it's just should guide you the rest spear! of the Spear! You probably have something else to do. I'm leaving you the anti-VS rifle. It might come in handy. Sorry I hesitated earlier. Never in my wildest dreams did I imagine I'd be shaking hands with a snow pirate. Yeah, the audio is way off. Still. How about that route Joe gave us? Good to go. Leave it to us. All right. It's time to go free our old friend Yuri. On ice. <laughs> Wait, what? The mission ain't over. Nah. I think we're gonna do one, you know, mission per episode. So many max. Woo! You dead? What's over there? Mine's still working, don't worry. Get another boss fight, really. <laughs> How are things on your end? Destination in sight. How about you? I'm trailing behind a bit, but I should catch up soon. Wait, talk to me. It's just a bit of unfinished business. Go on ahead and rescue Yuri. Is it a weird doctor? A little sibling rivalry. Rick, take care of Luca for me. Sip, huh? Okay. You're simply with that? What? Hey, how's that light doing? You bounce back fast, just like me. So tell me, 
What did Gale do to you? Something to do with this thing, right? You know what bothers me? What? That I don't have that mech? I don't know what you're capable of, but you're an itch I can't scratch. I didn't care when I thought the experimental model was just that witch. But then I come to find that I was just another prototype. I'm just a worthless stepping stone for some damn kid! That VS belongs to me. I'm not finished! You're just like your father. Talking down to me with that same damn holier-than-thou attitude. The VS belongs to you, huh? Wanna switch? You want it? Come and get it! I think you know where this is heading. Have it your way. I'll come and get it, all right. Looks like it's time to retire your model. Ah! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! I feel like this is really not the place for his model. Where are they? Wait, no, no, no. Bad mech pilot. Did you do that? Target marks. Yeah, I don't really care about them. <laughs> this is where I end the episode. Huge thanks for watching. And if you'd like to do me a favor, please comment on that down below to let me know some extra made it to the end. Aside from this, feel free to leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe for more. Goodbye.